Beckers here from Wonderful Web TV. This week I'd like to show you my New Guinea spears and there's a business lesson behind these. So this beautiful set of spears was a gift that was given to my husband and I when we'd done some volunteer work up in the, um, up in the mountains in Papua New Guinea. And the thing is they were actually spears that are being, were being used at the time. Now here's an interesting thing, you'll notice that the ends of the spears are different and that's because they have a different purpose. For example, these spears here that have got the four prongs and a lighter are used for fish and for birds and these other ones that are the bigger ones that are quite barbed and quite strong, they're used for bigger animals like pigs and apparently humans. <laughs> so we were told whether that was true or not. So the, the business lesson from this, I just love these spheres, they've got such a beautiful culture and history to them. But the business story for you is if you try to bring down a pig with the spear that is designed for fish, you're not going to get much action there. And the other way around, if you try to catch a bird or a fish with one of those big spears, you're just going to you're just going to really destroy it. So the big lesson here is in using the right tool for solving the right problem. Now, to give you an example, as this relates to building a business, leveraging the internet, as something I see a lot is people may be launching something like an ebook. Something that is something small that they're starting out with. And they totally, totally, instead of just using the spear that's used for fish, they bring out the works. And you may have done this where you, you could go and you get a very, very expensive website built that's got all of the bells and whistles. You know all the different things you could be doing and you want to have them all on that website. You get the beautiful professional branding done and you've probably gone and got a thousand business cards and flyers done as well. And you know, you've spent thousands and thousands of dollars and you don't even know if it's going to work. You know, you've written this one ebook that you think people need, is it going to work? So that's the case of, you know, when, and I see this a lot, where you've really overkilled and you've used a lot of money to get there. Now the other side that happens is when I see people who are setting themselves up with a very professional branding business, they are already getting solutions for people offline and now they're wanting to take it online. So they know there's a demand for their business because they're already helping people, they're already getting results for people. They want to be building a professional brand on the internet, but what they do is they destroy it by having really cheap, crummy graphics that they've tried to whip up themselves. They'll have a website that when you look at it has got homemade written all over it. And really, you know, they've tried to just get by with the fish spear, when really they should have been investing in getting really professional branding done on that website because they know it's going to work anyway. They're already making money by helping people. So it's a good investment. So that's my business lesson from you, for you from my Papua New Guinea Spears. Um, love to hear your ideas. Do you think, um, you know, have you had experience before where you've used the wrong tool for the, for the wrong job? And, um, and any questions that you've got, please, I'd love to be able to hear them. So just leave them down below and I'll come enjoy the conversation. Bye.